Hello, and today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new Sonic Sight VMT Maker. Um, me and Sonic Sight have been working on this. He programmed it. I gave him all the code that he needs. It's currently in the beta stages. If you contact me or Sonic Sight, we might be able to get you into the beta of it. When you get the program, even when it gets released, you'll get Visual Basic Power Pack. .exe, you have to install that and then it's just an exe and you also have a templates folder the great thing about this program is that not only does it do the most basic functions of VMT creation but it does harder things because most people believe it or not do not know how to do reflections on a VMT when here I'm just going to choose my base texture and it's just going to be this test texture that we have set up over here and if I want a bump map, because I have a normal, I can just click browse and then select it. Now those will be added. That's how easy this program is to work. And you can just choose a surface prop. There's every surface prop that's listed on the Valve Developer Wiki here. So you have pretty much an unlimited amount of options for what you want. You also have the ability to make a translucent or two textures for um, world vertex transition. So, that's really helpful if you want to do that. You also have translucent and SS bump, but SS bump is definitely orange box only. And on each thing, there is a tool tip that helps you along with if you have questions on what each item is. And now, most people don't know how to do reflections, but with this tool, it makes it really simple. You just reflections, you click enable, and now there will be reflections on this. It's just that simple. And you can choose NV map tint and tint the color of it. It gives you a live preview of what of what color you're going to get from it. Most people just use this to tone down how much reflectivity there is on an NV map, but that'll be later. And you have all your settings that you want, even an NV map mask. So and now if you do refracts and some people don't know what a refract is you saw the waterfall tutorial or video refracting is what happens behind it so it takes what's behind it and refracts out of it and to unlock the refract tab all you have to do is choose refract shader and now you have the options to do this you can choose normal map do doof map refract tint and tint texture and all these great settings that are awesome to have and on miscellaneous we just have some basic things like decal decal sale model no call alpha test under tool commands are some things that just are great to have well there's not many here but they do help and like this one tile for keyword and now for the really big thing that most people don't know how to do animating the uh, material to do this it's super simple now if you want it to scroll you just click enable and now it'll scroll the texture and if you want to animate you just click enable and it'll go all by itself it does all the hard work for you and let's say that you do know some VMT code if you actually know some VMT code and the command isn't here you can use this to customly add it. You just type in the variable that you want. Like I want. I'll just make up a value of testing. And the value will be 1. You click add and now it's added under the custom tab. And then you can click save the MT. And we're just going to name this tile test. You can open that up now. And there's the entire material that we just created. It works very fast. It's not a bad tool to have. And when it gets released, I'll definitely be using this. And this is how I'll show people how to make materials from now on. And also, let's say you really like this preset that we have. You can click Save This Template. You can save this template creates the file wherever you told it to save to now you can close the VMT maker 
can reload it at any time. It starts off with the default template, but you can hit load template, click test, and now all the values that we had before are still here, even the custom custom values that we had. So it's a great tool to have. I will send out basically a mass message when this is done, and this will be in all my videos from this point on, basically. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.